It is for us, and it will remain for us, the only valid reference, the only relevant precedent in this negotiation. And it was agreed by both sides. Yet, round after round, our British counterparts seek to distance themselves from this common basis. In all areas, the UK continues to backtrack on the commitments it has undertaken in the political declaration, including on fisheries, where we committed to use our best endeavors to conclude and ratify a new agreement by the 1st of July 2020. It seems clear that we will not reach the target considering how the negotiations in this area are going for the moment. Even, ladies and gentlemen, in the rare areas where we saw some movement this week, such as the European Convention on Human Rights, we still fall short of what we had agreed in the political declaration. And finally, as a reminder, the UK since the beginning does not want to talk about our cooperation on foreign policy, development and defense at all, even though we agreed this with Boris Johnson in the political declaration. And to tell the truth on these points, defense and foreign policy, also as a former foreign affairs minister in my own country, I still don't understand why. We cannot and we will not accept this backtracking on the political declaration. And at the same time, we will request the full respect of the withdrawal agreement.